Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. In today's video, I'm gonna do Daisy Keach's Hourglass workout for two weeks. I heard a lot of things about this workout and I saw a lot of people getting like amazing results. So I really wanna try it because summer's coming around. So gotta work on that summer body. I'm also gonna show you guys everything I'm gonna eat in these two weeks. I'm not gonna restrict myself from anything though. I'm just gonna eat whatever I want. So the only thing I'm not gonna eat is meat and fish because I'm vegetarian. I already set up my mat so we can get get started with the first day of the workout I don't have like a measurement band thingy with me right now but I'm gonna measure my waist and my hips tonight so I'm gonna put it on the screen so this is what my body looked like before I started the workout challenge and even though I have like a pretty skinny body type my stomach used to get bloated really fast so I was always pretty insecure about that just so you guys know I didn't film every single workout I did because I thought it would be boring for you guys just seeing me do the same thing 14 times in this video so I filmed it sometimes but not every single time that didn't mean I didn't do it though. I, I did do it. Okay, here it is. Let's get started. I'm done with the workout. I'm really sweaty right now, so I gotta take a shower. But the workout was not as hard as I thought it would be. Maybe because it's also only 10 minutes. But it's like alright, and I feel like everyone could do it. And it's also nice because it's so short that it like always fits in your day. So I like it so far, and I'm gonna get ready now. See you guys tomorrow when I do my next workout. So for breakfast, I have this kind of like oat muesli with chocolate chips and almond milk. And I also made some eggs with basil and tomato for Livio and me. And I like to put the eggs on my toast. Then for for lunch i made these hummus avocado toasts as you can tell i really like toast um but yeah i also topped them with tomatoes and some balsamic vinegar guys i don't think i've ever been as bored as i am right now in my entire life so let's say you guess what do i do when i'm bored i bake and i cook so let's make some crabs crepes crabs crappy but i need to be really quiet because my family's already asleep even though it's only like 7 p.m they always go to bed so early i don't know why then i went into the kitchen and made myself some crepes i still don't know if that's the right pronunciation but it's fine and then i also had a salad Day two started off pretty unhealthy because I had this big portion of cinnamon toast crunch with almond milk. Then for lunch, I got two sweet potato rice wraps and these are so, so good. And then for dinner, I had this pizza with rugola mascarpone. I don't know if that's an English word. And tomatoes on top of it. Okay, guys, it is day two of the workout challenge. I'm here with Livio. We're going to do the workout together and we're going to watch each other so no one can quit during the workout. So we're both like trying our best the entire time. Time. We only have one mat. I don't know how this is gonna work. It, it's probably gonna be really, really um tight. Tight? No. But we're gonna make it work and okay. yeah. Okay, let's get started with the workout. Today I'm having some chocolate muesli with almond milk. Oh my god, my hair. <laughs> then for lunch, I just had pasta without anything else, so it was not the best meal, but you know, it was fine. It's time for a new workout, so I'm ready. Let's get started. Shit, like I don't even know. What's the point? Like I don't even know. You just make me feel like shit sometimes. I think you should start to know that because as soon as you do, you can start to accept that you're the piece of shit. Now, fuck you. Yeah, running, running, got me gunning, gunning. My old school cat, got me sunning, sunning. Funny how the rest, but I'm coming, coming. Funny how you back for the love, and I've been. I got one too many drinks on my sleeve. I'm awesome, need overdose of empathy, my pops. For dinner, I made this rice bowl with vegan chicken, broccoli, sweet potatoes, and avocado, and just put some salad dressing on top of it. Then I also had a Coke because it's all about balance. 
For breakfast, I had this big bowl of grapes because I'm usually not that hungry in the morning, so I like eating light stuff. Good morning, guys. It is time for a new workout. So I'm really motivated right now. My abs are feeling kind of sore from yesterday, which is good. I love when I can like feel that the workout is doing something. Funny how you back for love and love and I got one too many tricks on my sleeve I mustn't leave overdose of empathy my pops and me more scream shots in me the streets are free go ahead and take from me Break a mirror if I fire with fear kicking the highest gear you're on the highest tier and when you're contemplating about a nation breaking don't erase a fight we'll take a say and take the mirror away As always I'm a little sweaty so I gotta take a shower I gotta go to work so See you guys when I eat lunch. For lunch, I just brought leftovers and they were super yummy. Now we can finally eat. We're gonna make some avocado pasta. Bolivia forgot to buy the almond milk. So we have to buy it now, but I'm really hungry. We're making some avocado pasta and Livio is using a lot of garlic because he wants to have bad breath. Check it out, check it out. And I don't really like garlic that much, so. I love bad breath. <laughs> it smells so bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. And always make sure to shake it. <laughs> <laughs> then we ate the avocado pasta. It was so good. It's one of my favorite meals ever. Please try it. I forgot to film breakfast, but I just used the same clip as I used before because I always eat the same thing when I'm at Livio's, just like the chocolate muesli with almond milk. And then for lunch, I just had the spinach tart and it was really good. Okay, my shorts are really, really short, so don't mind that. But it's time for another workout. What's there to say? There's nothing but space in between you and I. It's okay that we change. But it feels kind of strange that you're not Okay, I'm done. It was not that exhausting today. Like, I'm not that tired. Maybe I'm getting, like, used to the workout or something. So, yeah, I'll see you guys when I eat something later. For dinner, I tried to make vegan scrambled eggs. I used the wrong kind of tofu, though, but it still came out pretty good. And then I put it on toast with basil, hummus, and tomatoes. On day six, I made one of my favorite breakfasts ever, and it's vegan French toast. It's so, so good. I want to eat it right now, actually. Maybe I'm going to make it later. Please try it. It's so simple and so, so yummy. Okay, guys, it's the next day, and it's workout time. So let's do it. I love doing the workout in the morning because then it's done, and I, I don't have to worry about it in the evening. You're the only one that saves me when I'm Why is it always so awkward and embarrassing when someone catches you working out? I don't know. We turn into a flower that never grows. I was hiding like the for lunch, I just brought the rest of my spinach tart and then for dinner, my family and I went to a restaurant So first I got a salad and then I got like eggplant ravioli and it was super yummy for breakfast, I just had a lot of bread and then I also had a boiled egg and then Livio spilled his coffee, typical as always. And for lunch, I had a slice of apple and raspberry tart. For dinner, I made this pizza and I actually filmed the video while doing that. So if you want to check it out, it's linked down below and somewhere on the screen. For breakfast, I had two grilled cheese sandwiches. They don't look that grilled in that clip, but they were. For lunch, I just had some leftover pizza. And for dinner, we made some fajitas and we used vegetarian meat, nacho chips, guacamole, and vegetables. I had to take a new milk and it's not cold yet. So I put some ice cubes in it. from grocery shopping so now i'm gonna make myself some lunch because i'm really hungry i already made myself a little salad i'm also gonna put some tomatoes on it for the main dish i'm gonna make myself these ravioli which are vegan so that's good i'm really excited because i'm so hungry and you okay so my lunch is ready also added some tomato sauce to make it more tasty today for dinner we're being really unhealthy and we're making some fries and veggie burgers with cheese and we also got some tomatoes and salad to put on top of it guys i'm so hungry and i didn't even do anything today our burgers are already done and we have some onions tomatoes and guacamole but i accidentally got the extra spicy one so i'm scared the fries are not done yet but we're just gonna eat this first so yeah i'm so excited the fries are done too yeah why are you laughing
Okay, I bought matcha powder today, so I tried to make myself a matcha latte for the first time. I wanted to take my first sip with you guys, but I already took like four. So, sorry. Okay, maybe I shouldn't drink this right now because it's already 9 p.m. And I should go to bed in like two hours. Okay, anyway, guys, I need to edit the video you're watching right now because I'm nowhere and this needs to go up this Sunday. For breakfast, I had some chocolate muesli again with soy milk and I also had an iced matcha latte with vanilla soy milk. Okay, workout time. I'm done and as always I need to take a shower. I sweat a lot today because I'm wearing long pants So yeah for lunch, I made a friend and we got some burritos and nachos. When we ate them, a homeless person came up to us and asked if he could have some food. And then I offered him my meal and he just looked at me so disgusted and was like, what are you eating? I told him I'm eating like a vegetarian burrito. And he was just like, nah, sorry, I want to eat fries. And then he walked away. Why did he not want my burrito? What, what was wrong with it? For dinner, I had this pita, day, which is basically pizza without tomato sauce. I think it's a Turkish dish and it was super good. For breakfast, I had some peanut butter toast and I topped them with banana slices. And then I also made a matcha latte. This time I didn't use vanilla soy milk, but soy milk with vanilla syrup. So it tastes pretty much the same. And I also filmed the video on that day. So I'll link it down below and on the screen in case you want to check it out. My dad made some mushroom risotto for lunch and I think I had two and a half portions or three, I'm not quite sure. Then for dinner, I had a pizza with grilled vegetables and no cheese and it was vegan, so that's super good. For breakfast, I wanted to try something I saw on TikTok and it's fried eggs, but instead of oil, you use pesto to fry them and they were actually really good. So I ate them with avocado and tomatoes on a toast. And for lunch, I had pizza again. I'm eating a lot of pizza in this video. <laughs> I think I had three slices. Then for dinner, I just had some bread with guacamole and an iced tea. For breakfast, I had some cookie crisps again, and we love cookie crisps on this channel. They were so good. I got a go nuts bowl with uh, peanut butter, mango, banana, and what is this? Granola. What did you get? Tropical dream bowl with mm -hmm. banana and kiwi. And what is this? Passion fruit? Yeah. For dinner, I got this poke bowl, and do you see that wasabi thing on top of the bowl? I thought it was a pea, and I just ate it like that, and I was choking so much, like I was dying. But then I also got a chocolate cake, and I was fine again. Oh my god, it's the last day. So for breakfast, I had some chocolate muesli with soy milk again. And then for lunch, me and Livio got Domino's pizza. I got the vegetariana, I think. And then for dinner, Livio's family invited me to eat some sushi. So as a starter, we got fried soybeans and sweet potato fries. And then for the main dish, I got a lot of sushi, as you can see. <laughs> so yeah, that was everything I ate in these two weeks. Before I show you guys the results, I want to show you what my body looked like before I started this challenge. Let me tell you, the difference is huge. I used to get bloated so fast. I always looked like I was like three months pregnant, I feel like. And I always used to be pretty insecure about that. But now I don't have that problem anymore. And I just feel so much more confident. And my body is so much more toned, as you can see. So I'm so happy. And I mean, after two weeks, that's crazy. So uh, yeah, I can definitely recommend it. Go with the brother, you know.